guess another fucking interesting story was when I copped my first fucking gang bash. <laughs> um, arrived at a party, saw all the younger CLS dudes, dudes in my crew, fucking, um, they were all having a fucking, um, a brawl with these massy fellas, all these island fellas, and they were sort of winning. But then this fucking cunt, he came down with a baseball bat and he started pointing it at all my mates. And I lost the fucking plot and just ran straight at this fucking dude with my 15 box of lime reds under my fucking, under my arm. And I just fucking pinched this fucking bottle of vodka from the, from the pistol and then that was stuffed in there as well and this fucking dude dropped his sex and fucking started bolting off up the road with this fucking baseball bat in his hand and I'm running off up the road fucking rip the vodka out fucking, ah! <laughs> fucking throw it at him all the big scene and shit but as I'm walking back down the hill this is all on the road outside the party fucking all these dudes just start walking up to me all these fucking Nari fellas and island fellas and shit and um and I knew it was fucking on straight away, so I just walked up, walked through them, and went up to my mate, you better fucking back me up, cunt. Walked up to my other mate, you better back me up, gun, park your fucking car up right now. And then I just took a couple of steps back, and they kept coming at me, and I was just like, fuck, you know, what the fuck are you stepping me for? And pushed this through two, dude. First dude fucking grabs me, and I'm like, wait, 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 <laughs> just fucking, you know, take him out, smashed his face up a bit. But then just got absolutely fucking annihilated, bro. These dudes fucking knocked me to the ground and then just proceeded to fucking kick the fucking shit out of me, bro. They kicked all the piercings I had in my face out. Like I had fucking 18 mil tunnels with eight gauge rings through them. Like, I don't know how they didn't tear my earlobe in half, but they tore my earlobe because they all got kicked out. Fucking tore my earlobe, fucking kicked my nose ring out, fucking my lip ring, all that shit. That was the last time I ever fucking put a piercing in, I'll tell you that. Fucking stomping me so fucking hard that my fucking shoe came flying off. My mate picked that up. <laughs> but, um, you know, I just remember fucking being on the ground. I couldn't feel shit because I was so pissed. I could just see flashes of light every time they kicked me in the head, you know. And um, and I was just fucking yelling at them. Fuck! Is that all you fucking got? Is you call that a hiding? <laughs> the whole time they're fucking kicking the fuck out of me, bro. These fork dudes, bro. And I just remember this chick made of mine fucking <laughs> fucking trying to pull them off me. And then my mate who was in the car fucking actually parked the car up. And um jumped out and just ran over and just fucking tackled them all off me, you know, and just dragged me to the fucking car, even though they're fucking still fucking stomping the shit out of me, and I'm still yelling at them and shit, and then they fucking throws me in the fucking car, and fucking, I'm hanging out the window, fuck yeah, you call that a fucking hiding, <laughs> fucking, went home and fucking hell, my dad found me fucking stuck to the front doormat, fucking in the for like the front of the house, fucking just covered in blood, fucking because I'd landed on a Jim Beam bottle that I had, and um, it exploded under my arm and slashed my arm up pretty bad, and um, because I was so pissed and fucking. It, the beating fucking took it out of me. I was just, as soon as I got in the fucking house, I just fucking collapsed on the front, you know, at the side of the stairs and fucking just KO'd there for the night. So I woke up to my dad just fucking kicking me, going, get up, get up. Jesus, what does the other cunt look like? And I was just like, fuck, just fucking take me to the accident emergency so I can get cleaned up, would you? Fucking had these big gashes up my arm and shit that needed fucking, well, one of them needed stitches and um, the rest just needed cleaning up, but fucking, yeah, it was a pretty fucking sore experience. <laughs> I could feel, I could count every, every 
you know, each hit that I copped because I had a lump. You know, I was like, one, two, three. <laughs> yeah, fucking, that's what you get for sticking up for your mates, but you got to do it. Yeah. <laughs> Still didn't knock me out. <laughs> <laughs> yeah.